Hello everyone, it's Old Guardian here. The Artstone Mercenaries Treasure revamp in February 2023 removed the Prideful Wish treasure from the game, so yeah, some achievements were kind of hurt by that. But what if I told you that something fun, haha, use Prideful Wish 10 times can still be completed in the game right now? And in this video, I'm going to show you how. The key to completing the something fun achievement is a specific bounty in Dark Moon Troop in normal difficulty, and we're going to go and meet the Babbling Book. Why? Because Babbling Book still has the Prideful Wish ability. Even though you can no longer get it as a treasure, you can steal it from Babbling Book. And in this video, I'm going to show you two ways to do that. Because there are two mercenaries in the game that can steal abilities from your enemies. First of all, there is Blink Fox, and preferably with the 10th tail ability so that you're going to guarantee the steal. And second, there is Tess Greymane, and with Tess, preferably with Cloak of Shadows equipment, so that once you steal Prideful Wish, you just have it permanently, so you're able to use it multiple times. Well, if Tess and Babbling Book survive after stealing the Prideful Wish, because Prideful Wish tends to kill people. But anyway, with either Blink Fox or with Tess, you can steal Prideful Wish from Babbling Book, and that enables you to progress the achievement. However, Babbling Book is a lot of random stuff, and often you just die or something, or they die, or something happens before you can even steal it, so you also want to minimize all that randomness. And that is where this comp comes in. I'm using Belinda Stoneheart with less water elemental, Ragnaros with Blazing Rune, Gedon with Mark of Conflagration. Yeah, I'm climbing with Belinda Rack Gedon. Just really fast climb. Then I'm using Born Somdi with Arena Contender. Tess with Cloak of Shadows, and then Natalie. I'm using Natalie with Eye of Divinity. So what do all of these mercs do? In the Babbling Book encounter, in order to steal that Frightful Wish, you will want Pawn Samdi, Belinda, and Tess. The others are completely optional. I'm just using Belinda Ragnar's Get on to Climb, and I have Natalie here, so Natalie can in theory heal Tess, and Natalie can heal Babbling Book, so that I can just try to keep all of them alive, even though it's sometimes a little bit difficult. In the Babbling Book encounter, Pawn Samdi, Belinda, you want to freeze the book, you want to kill the adds, isolate the book, steal the ability, and then roll on. And I have some footage showing how to do that with Tess in the team, showing how to do that with Blink Fox in the team if you don't have Tess, and this is what it all looks like in action. All right, then we're gonna do a bounce. We're gonna start shooting. And we don't want the random stuff. So no random stuff, please. There, we got the freeze on the book. That's a start. We're trying to isolate the book here. Bon Samdi, Alinda. We can bring Ragnars again. Work on isolating that book. Another bounce. Freeze and oh, we need to freeze that one over with this one and this one with that one because the other one was slowed. Here we go, here we go. All right, Buki is almost, almost isolated. One more bounce, I think. One more bounce. One more time with the bounce. We get to work on this one. 
Might as well hit into it with all of these. That's 30 damage. 30 damage is good. Here we go, here we go. Looking nice. This is the final bounce. Then we bring the blink box. Belinda, Blink, Fox. The last one can be Rag again. It's totally fine. Maybe I could have brought some kind of, like a healer instead of Cookie or something. Try to drag this on. That was an option. It would cast Prideful Wish now, but it can't. Well, we keep hitting in this one. So let's count the damage. 16 plus 22, that's 38. 48, 58, 62 damage. So then we do one hit with one of these and boom. Alright, we're true. We're true here. Wonderful. And then... I have a Doom Charge. But I don't want to keep this Doom Charge. I will get rid of it. Right. Something like this. Should have brought a healer instead of Cookie so that I could bring a healer here. I don't want Babbling Book to cast spells upon. I still have that Doom Charge. Yeah, I just... Now, Prideful Wish. Yes. I will spend the Doom Charge so just in case here. And now, Babbling Book casts a Prideful Wish. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. I have a Prideful Wish. Look at this. That's a prideful wish right there. I have now cast a prideful wish. Sadly, I only managed to cast one prideful wish on this run. But it's doable, it's possible. Prideful wish. Just go for the achievement. Get the prideful wish for yourself. Still in the game. Bounce. I do hate that fork. And I really need to prevent the randomness there. So here we go. Bounce. Get to work on the fork. Get the freeze on the bubbling book so that we prevent all random occurrences. Yeah, Somebody, Belinda, Ragnars again. We're working on isolating the book. We're going to freeze both of these now. Okay. Freeze there, freeze there. Wonderful. That's bounce number two. One more time, we go for a bounce number three. On Samdi, Valinda, Ragnaros. Hi, Mare Machine. Oh, 
everyone frozen. Oh, really too bad. Deal of fear again here. Most take critical damage until they act, so I'm actually just going to hit into this a couple of times here. Before I kill the fork. Here we go. Any budget decks? Well, the Face Hunter deck can be built as a budget deck. Other than that, I haven't had a chance to try yet. Alright, now we have done the bounces that I needed. I might still have more bounces coming if I really want to. But we can just do Belinda as well. Bring Natalie, bring Tess. Here we go. Mm, on my YouTube channel there's a video of the Face Hunter deck. The budget version. Let me just blast into that one a little bit. 10 damage. 10 damage, that's fine. We'll do this. The more popular one is the Wild Seed version. But if you're really if you're really on a budget, then you can't afford the Wild Seeds, I guess. So here now. We freeze when Book tries to do spells of fun. Oopsie, I don't want to use that. I don't let books do spells of fun. Right. Why is it four speed? Was it always four speed? I haven't done anything to slow it. No. But I got the copy anyway. I got the copy anyway. Wonderful. Now we can do Prideful Wish. No! Well, we got one Prideful Wish out of that. Prideful wish. Thank you for watching. Click like and subscribe if you enjoyed this. And a special thanks to all of my Patreon supporters, YouTube members and Twitch subscribers who make all of these videos possible.